I suppose I should tell you about this character. I haven't named him, besides just going by Maddox. He's a bit of a scavenger, and adds to his armor and tech with objects and devices he finds or, um, acquires. Most of his weapons and gear are found and repurposed objects, kind of like this actual build. On this channel, I pretend to know what I'm doing. It sort of works out that way once I cut out all the times I take a misstep. So, yes, I know exactly what I'm doing with this piece. Just kidding. I very rarely know what's about to happen. I suppose that's where the phrase, I'm gonna mess this up so that you don't have to, comes from. So if it appears like I have all the answers, I don't. And maybe neither do you, but this channel is to show you that nothing is out of reach. What's the worst that could happen? It doesn't work? It won't come together right? Well, you tried it and you learned something. Now go back and formulate another plan until you make it work. We're all making this up as we go along. So this build, it's a part two. I did all the painting and weathering and now I need to figure out how to attach it to my chest. I scoured Etsy for really nice harnesses made out of leather from incredibly talented people across the globe, but they were kind of pricey. So I got an idea, my Eureka moment. I checked for GoPro mounts. I figured there must be something out there that will do what that beautiful leather work does, but also provide a built-in attach point. 15 bucks, yo. Literally came out of that with everything I need for 15 bucks. So I thought. I still need to add an attach point to the chest box, which brings us to what you're seeing on screen. My first thought was to glue a GoPro mount to the back and just call it a day, but thought it might be a bit too sticky outy. So I cut into a test piece, I drilled test holes, and then when I was finally ready to make the final decisions, I cut up this white piece, drilled the correct holes, and voila, mounted chess piece. Peace.